In your opinion, what is an album with no bad songs? Rumors Fleetwood Mac. Songs in the key of life Stevie Wonder I Wish. Sir Duke. Black Man. Isn't she lovely? Knocks me off my feet. As. My fave. Ordinary Pain. Joy Inside My Tears. Talking Book by Stevie Wonder is also a gem. Good Kid M. A. A. D City. Miles Davis. Kind of Blue This Is. Emo. A Perfect Album. Daft Punk Discovery. Bingo. Stop Making Sense. Talking Heads. The Best Concert Film Ever. Ziggy Stardust. An Absolute Masterpiece. Moon Edge Daydream is my favorite off the album. Disintegration by The Cure. Yes. South Park was right that this album is just gold front to back. Fleetwood Mac Rumors Eminem The Marshall Mathers LP. Edit. Thank you all for your awards and upvotes. I just want to add a few things. Oh Daddy and Songbird aren't bad songs. They just struggle against how good the others on the album are. Same goes for Kim on MMLP. Skits aside it's superb album. Go Your Own Way may be the most perfect song ever recorded. Each instrument is perfectly played to be good on its own, but better when combined. Please check out my mate's new EP on Bandcamp. He's a rapper from Limerick, Island, but this new album is next level from his last one. Different style. Very laid back. Hazy Haze my personal favorites are Melting Moon and Enough. Favorite. Check it out and let me know what you think. Led Zeppelin 4. 36 Chambers Wu-Tang Clan. Artists come and go. Wish you were here. Pink Floyd. Time out. The Dave Brubeck Quartet first jazz album to reach 1M sales. Also first jazz single. Time out. To reach the same milestone. Ro. Thanks for all the love everyone. My father was a big jazz fan and was from that era. He had some Brubeck records and I'm starting my own collection of vinyl I recently got countdown. Time in outer space also. Studio album. Pink Floyd The Dark Side of the Moon. Live album. Nirvana Unplugged in New York. Nirvana Unplugged is one of the greatest albums ever recorded. Black Sabbath by Black Sabbath. Black Sabbath by Black Sabbath off their self-title album. Pixies. Doolittle. Good one. Surfer Rosa 2. Gorillaz Demon Days. I got to see Gorillaz whenever they toured for humans. They ended the show with Don't Get Lost in Heaven and Demon Days and I can't even begin to describe the nostalgia and emotion it hit me with. Deltron 3030. I want you all to meet Deltron Zero. Is this it by The Strokes? The Strokes have no bad songs. Only songs you haven't heard enough. R.A.T.M. Self-titled. It's so raw and you can feel the emotions is why I think self-titled is their best. Enema. Masterpiece. Cause I'm praying for rain I'm praying for tidal waves I wanna see the ground give way I wanna watch it all go down mom. Please flush it all away I wanna see it go right in and down I wanna watch it go right in watch you flush it all away. Okay computer edits to say thanks for the awards folks. They are my first and are truly unexpected. Just wanted to show Radiohead some love. Queens of the Stone Age. Songs for the Deaf. This album just solid. Nazilmatic. A Tribe Called Quest People Instinctive. Tribe's first three albums. Violator by Depeche Mode. Perfect from start to finish. Toxicity by System of a Down. Massive Attack Mezzanine. There's honestly so many others I could list but you did only ask for one. Edit. To everybody that recommended Tricky. Thank you. I checked out two of his albums already. Pre-Millennium Tension and Max and Quay. And am definitely a fan already. Smiling face with smiling eyes and rosy cheeks. Smiling face with smiling eyes and rosy cheeks. Dark side of the moon. Pearl Jam. 10. Hybrid Theory. Both Meteora and Hybrid Theory for me. Graceland. Paul Simon. Wildflowers by Tom Petty. I'm glad so many people love this. And thanks for the award. My brother played me this album when I was about 11 and I instantly loved it. To this day it's my absolute favorite and even my kids love it too. Mad Villainy. MF Doom. Madlib. Edit. Failed to mention Madlib originally. I can't be sleeping on the legend himself. Rip to the goat MF Doom. Pretty Hate Machine 9 Inch Nails. Downward Spiral. Dirt Alice in Chains. Siamese Dream. Smashing Pumpkins. Mayonnaise is amazing. D. Laust and the Comatorium. Meteora. Perfect Album. The Blue Album Weezer. Oh Brother Where Art Thou Soundtrack 3 Eb 3 Eb. Gorillaz Phase 1 Album. There is nothing like early era gorillas. Good pick.
I'm late to this party so this will get buried. But the Prodigy's The Fat of the Land is one of the seminal electronic albums of the British canon and set the tone for an entire generation of big beat producers. Firestarter, Breathe, Smack My Beach Up, Minfields, every single track was a booming, pulsing anthem to anarchy that immediately grabbed you by the shoulders and shook you awake. Liam Howlett's nefeasance and pounding basses filled you with an aggressive energy impossible to ignore. Keith Flynn's punchy vocals gave you permission, ordered you, sometimes, to smash shoot up and take no prisoners. TFOTL was an enduring force of nature like no big beat album before it, completely changing the landscape of electronic music. Even now, some 25 years later, you'd be hard pressed to find many people who wouldn't immediately recognize Firestarter's iconic opening riff or be able to reel off smack my beach up's controversial lyrics. Anyway. If it's been a while since you heard it, or if by some terrible confluence of events you've never heard it, do yourself a favor and fire up Spotify now, you won't regret it. The Miseducation of Lauren Hill, Brothers in Arms by Dire Straits, Rubber Soul, In Rainbow's Radiohead, Alanis Morissette Jagged Little Pill Edit, thank you all for the awards. This is the first time I get awards on Reddit, it made my weekend. Boston, Boston, Frank Ocean. Blonde, Super Tramp, Breakfast in America, Funkadelic, Maggot Brain, Nirvana Unplugged in New York, Deftones, White Pony, Rush 2112, Harvest, Neil Young, Audio Slave, Audio Slave, Foo Fighters, The Color and the Shape, Ah by Steely Dan, The Black Parade by My Chemical Romance ETA, A Quick Funny Story About This Album. I was at my pre-operative appointment last week and they did a whole bunch of tests in preparation for surgery. Anyway, they needed to take a bunch of blood. When the tech came in to do it, my mom asked if she could put on music while he did it. He said yes. My mom proceeded to play blood and then dead. I was cracking up and the tech was bopping. It was awesome. Garbage version 2. Zero. Ride the lightning. Nazilmatic. The seeds of love tears for fears. Mastodon. Crack the Sky, Hot Fuss by the Colors, Green Day Ducky, In the Aeroplane Over the Sea, White Blood Cells White Stripes, Sergeant, Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band, The Beatles, Now, This Is Music 27, Deja Antendu by Brand New, Abbey Road, The Miseducation of Lauren Hill, Blood Sugar Sex Magic, Red Hot Chili Peppers, The Downward Spiral, Sublime, 40 Ounces to Freedom, Fiona Apple, Tidal, Back in Black, ACDC, lots of reasonable options, but haven't seen this one yet so you'll state it, Jaggy Little Pill by Alanis Morissette, Third Eye Blind debut self-titled album, 14 tracks and not a skip among them, Pearl Jam 10, Marvin Gaye's, What's Going On, Arctic Monkeys AM, Enema of the State Blink 182, From Under the Cork Tree, Bat Out of Hell, Sports by Huey Lewis and the News their early work was a little too new wave for my taste, but when Sports came out in 83, I think they really came into their own, commercially and artistically. The whole album has a clear, crisp sound, and a new sheen of consummate professionalism that really gives the songs a big boost. He's been compared to Elvis Costello, but I think Huey has a far more bitter, cynical sense of humor. Counting Crows, August and Everything After. MBDTF, Sarah McLaughlin's fumbling towards ecstasy speaks to my soul, I was going to comment but, never mind, Alice in Chains, Dirt, MF Doom, MM, Food, Buena Vista Social Club, Is This It, The Strokes, Live Throwing Copper, Arcade Fire, The Suburbs, Can't Believe I Haven't Seen This Yet But, Michael Jackson, Thriller, The Joshua Tree, From Mars to Sirius Gojira, Dire Straits, Brothers in Arms John Coltrane, Blue Train, XX by the XX, Pearl Jam 10, Super Unknown Soundgarden Appetite for Destruction, G&R Animosity 7 Dust, Fleetwood Mac Rumors, Cake Fashion Nugget, Radiohead The Bents, Incubus, Make Yourself and Morning View, The Door Self-Titled Debut Janis Joplin, I Got Dem All Cosmic Blues Again Mama, Elton John, Goodbye Yellow Brick Road, Panic at the Disco, a fever you can't sweat out Frank Ocean, Channel Orange Childless, All's Well That Ends Well, Boston by Boston, I got the record originally only knowing more than a feeling, 
and now I can't pick a favorite. Songs in the key of life. Stevie Wonder. Till. Reddit is used primarily by white people. Hysteria by Def Leppard. In keeping secrets of Silent Earth. 3. Toxicity. American Idiot Green Day. Purple Rain Prince. LP Hybrid Theory. Kid See Ghosts. Riot. Paramore. Michael Jackson's Bad Album. Some of his most popular songs come from that album. David Bowie Hunky Dory. I know that the three people who read this probably won't agree but. The soundtrack for Disney's Tarzan. I don't know why a bunch of people don't like it. But every song slaps. Phil Collins put way more into it than he needed to. But damn. The soundtrack makes the movie so much better.